don't know about y'all, but I heard that praise report, and I thank God that she told it because I was thinking about who was going to tell it. Yeah. And I just thank God, and the choir is coming, and you just get with the choirs, and again, we're preparing for the ministerial council. Annabelle, we need to be in the house. We need to be in the house. And so we're looking forward to all of you being in the house. If you want more word, come and get more word. If you need a prayer, come and get your prayer request in. And above all, just being in the midst, in the power of the Lord. You don't know what God got to refresh you. Hiya! Lord, refresh you with. So our choir is coming. Pray with us. Pray for us. As we come offering songs of Zion and lifting him up and praise him.
this generation. Amen. His mercy endures for all generations. We thank God for it. We thank God for all of you one by one. We're praying for uh, uh, Deacon Kelly. Amen. Amen. Yeah. Mother Kelly told me that he had gotten a little, little sick. And uh, we're praying for him, having in mind, yes. just like all the others. Yes. And we believe in God for him. Yes, yes, yes. Minister. Yes. It's our idea not to ever forget the old minister mm -hmm. because he taught us things. That's it. The old minister used to teach us, he said, pray the prayer of faith. Yeah. Uh -huh. Pray the prayer of, pray of faith. Yes, God. And that's what we got to do. That's it. One that's so sick. Yeah. We have to pray the prayer of faith for that individual. All right, Bishop. Yeah, Lord. Sometimes they're not able to act for yeah. him. But we know that God is able. Yeah. God can do yeah. anything. Yeah. If you don't know it, the Lord left me here. Yeah. Live by yeah. longer. Yeah. Let you know that he yeah. is able. Yeah. Hallelujah. Yeah. To have faith in God. Yeah. Not in me. Mm -hmm. I don't care how well I say it. Or how ugly I say it or whatever. But have faith in God. Amen. Hallelujah. Look beyond me and see Jesus. Yeah. That's all that I'm an instrument yeah. in his hand. Hallelujah. Because I can't do it. If I knew how to do it, I would. Hallelujah. But I don't know how. Not in our hand, it's in God. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. And He will do it. Yes, Trust it Him. Trust Him and believe it. Praying for everybody. Yes, Lord. One by one. The Lord let me know some time ago that the world is in a backslide state. Yes, God. Hallelujah. Somebody said, they don't like for you to say that. And I can't help it. Amen. That's what the Lord told me. Amen. And I looked at the world and showed up. Is in a backslide state. Yes, I have seen yes, some yes, things happen yes, that never would have happened in the past. Yes, it wouldn't have happened in the forties. It wouldn't have happened in the fifties and the sixties. Right. Hallelujah! Showing sure up in the seventies, you know, uh, things began to go kind of down a little bit. Yes. Amen. Amen. But it never would have happened when I was a child. Yes. The thing that people do now and get away with. Uh -huh. Amen. Never happen. Amen. Never happen. Mm -hmm. So it's prayer time. Yes, prayer. Hallelujah. Yeah, Hallelujah. Come on, let's get it all some praise. Yes, Lord. Yes, Lord. Yes, Lord.
said, you didn't go there. You didn't go there. If you ever go there, you ain't getting out. Nah, nah, nah. No, you ain't getting out, but you get a taste of it. Yeah. Lord, wow. Lord showed me how bad yeah. it's going to be. And I, yeah. and I dreaded that. If I die, I know that's a sinner. Yeah. If I die the way I am, yes, sir. I said, I'm, I'm not going. I'm not going to make it. And I felt like I didn't have the faith. Hallelujah. But I had to move on what I knew. When the saints would tell me things to do, I went and did it. They said, come to the terrorist service. I came to the terrorist service. Let's go to church. I said, okay, I'm going. Yeah, those things I could do physically. But I was afraid. Because I knew how bad that other place is. Hallelujah. It's a terrible place. And it's a place you don't get out of. Huh? Yeah, you don't get out of there once you go there. Some folks say, yeah, yeah, I went to here. No, you didn't. Uh, if you ain't went there, you, you don't get out. Uh, you don't get out. You, you may have seen and had a vision of it, but that's a place you don't get out of. That's why I plead with the saints so. You don't want to go to that place. Amen. You want to do the simple things now. The simple things is be baptized in Jesus' name. Amen. The simple things is come and tear. Father, you receive the Holy Ghost. Yeah, and you can make it easy for yourself. Huh? Yeah, I don't like to tell you this, though, but, you know, you can, I'd rather for you to come to the church and tear. But if you just can't make it, you can go home. I got, I got. Go in your prayer room. How many got a prayer room? Yes, yes, yes. I don't have a prayer room. I, 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 want you to, I want to admonish you to get to a prayer room. Yes, go in, go in and go in there. This is your meeting place for God. Yes, so this is where I'm going to meet him. And I want you to know that the Lord will meet you there. Yes, yes. I got a prayer room. I used to have one a little bit closer to our bedroom, but I moved it down on the end. Yes, and when I go in there, the Lord meet me there. Amen. Thank you, Lord. He gonna talk to you one way or the other. Amen. Sometimes you cut on your radios. Uh, how many got a radio in your prayer room? I got a radio. It don't nothing but gospel. That's it. Amen. Yeah, gospel and preaching. Amen. Sometimes I hear those Caucasian brothers. And I cut them on. How many know we got some Caucasian yes, brothers? Amen. Cut it on, they tell you some good things. They don't give you no foolishness. Uh -huh. You know, sometimes, Lord, but let me leave that alone. God's a good God. Mm -hmm. But go in that place and wait on God. God will meet you there. This is what I do. I go in there and pray. Ain't no foolishness going on in there. Right now. Hallelujah. Mm -hmm. Ain't nothing else going on but spiritual things. Right now. Listen to the gospel and pray and ask the Lord, man. God will meet you. You need that. You need that. Go in your prayer room and tear. Tear it. Tear me to wait on God. Mm -hmm. Wait on. I said I'm not going to do too much talking today, but I said I got to tell you something. You need to wait on God. Is that right? Go in there and wait on God. Wait on him. How long, brother Curtis? Wait until he comes. Because you need him. Let me tell you, since you're here in my presence, the most important thing is that you be saved. That's it. And continue to be saved. That's it. It's about you being sanctified and holy over the peace. So you'll be able to meet God face in peace. Hallelujah. Don't let the enemy fool you now. Hallelujah. Because Mother Curtis and I have been talking. Said, what happened? I got it. I got it. I know sometimes we want to know what happened. Right now. The enemy is sending yeah. some strong delusion. Oh, yeah. Some strong delusion. Yes, Lord. Folks think stuff going on ain't happening. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Tricking you. Fooling you. Yeah. It's time now. Right now. Good, good, good. Get clone.
going to do. Amen. Hallelujah. These things that is happening now is the message that we heard. That's it. Amen. Hallelujah. Amen. Brother Curtis and I heard this when we were young boys. That's it. Yeah, when my hair was totally black. All right now. Hallelujah. When I ain't had no length to the day that I could go out on any given day. Amen. Thank you. I better let y'all know what that means. Athletes know what any given day. Any day, I just pick a day at random. Because I'm going around my house. Just any day. I'll be never have rain, have train, and nothing. Just run a mile. Any given day. Those days are gone now. They're gone. Hallelujah. But you better see him like never before. Right now. Right now. You can see the sign, but you don't know what you're looking at. You see the sign. You can be scared about what's happening. But all this is letting you know that your time is running out. Hallelujah. Before you know it, any day now, the Lord may just show up. Amen. Some of y'all are going to get ready to go to work. There ain't going to be no work. You're going to get up and, the Bishop Harrison said, say, business ain't you. you know, it won't be. It's coming. I see it's coming. I see it's coming. And when time gets a little bit better, I'm going to tell you why. Hallelujah. God is good. He's merciful in time. We thank God for all things in Jesus' name. Do come to the council. Do come praying. Come praying. Amen. Amen. Come praying like never before. Yes, God. Yes. I, I need to talk to certain ones before we go into the council. Is that right? Amen. Yeah. And I hope I get a chance. I, and I like to know your talent, what you can do. That's it. Sometimes I don't know all your talents. All right. I find out what you can do. Then, you know, as we go, we'll work with you into what we are doing. Today we do honor the Lord today in the presence of the ministers, yes, yes, one by one. We thank God for our deacons, brothers, trustees, mothers, missionary saints, and friends. Hallelujah. Today we just want to talk to you today in the word of God. Hallelujah. No reflection on nobody else. That's just the way I see it. In the word of God. Amen. God is truly good. Yes, he is. Yes, Lord. And God got you in his heart. It's not God's will for any of us to be lost. Amen. If I be lost, huh? If, nobody if I nobody be lost, yeah. Yeah. say it again, sister. If nobody lost, nobody. Hallelujah. If I be lost, yeah. nobody fault but mine. Yeah. If you be lost, yeah. nobody fault yeah. but you. Yeah. Hallelujah. Yeah. Ten folks. You can't put it on God. You can't put it on anybody. Because God gave all of us amp enough time. Especially if you don't pass 12 or 13 years old. That's right, Hallelujah. You have, by then you have your own mind. Yes. Nobody can make you do anything. Some folks are waiting for the last minute salvation. Because they look at the man on the cross. And the man on the cross, hallelujah, more or less, wanted God to, to remember him. Yes. Thank you. When they go in the kingdom. Hallelujah. He said, Well, you see, he got saved at the last minute. You better not depend on last minute. <laughs> that is. Right. No. Last minute salvation is a terrible is. salvation to look on. Uh, to look at. Let me tell you. Hallelujah. I'm about ready to preach it now. Let me tell you what happened in that last minute salvation. Jesus was still, hallelujah, he was still here. Hallelujah. Thank you, Lord. And he met that man in the grave. Uh -huh. Uh -huh. Come on. Amen. He met him in the grave. Amen. He preached to the captured spirit. Yes. Yes. Thank you, Lord. Hallelujah. That's, that was that man way out. But if you go in the grave,
grave now, you ain't gonna meet him in the grave. Amen. <laughs> Hallelujah. He rose. Yes, he did. Hallelujah. Yeah. 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 He rose. Yeah. He went in the grave and he rose. Yes, he did. Yeah. Yeah. Hallelujah. Yes, he did. And he went back on high. Yeah. That's where he is now. Right if you you want to meet him, you better try to look toward heaven. Yes, Lord. Amen. Yeah, go ahead and do what he told you to do right now. And as I'm concerned, ain't no such thing as last minute salvation. Uh, if it was, everybody would be waiting till the last minute. They do, all the, they do all the cutting up they want to do. Huh? All the drinking. All the smoking they want to do. Marijuana, they do everything they want to do. All the sin. Then they say, well, I'm going in at the last minute. I preach it all the time that Jesus Christ is the same. Amen. Today, today and forever. Malachi 3 tell you, the Lord said, I am the Lord and I change not. Uh, yeah, yeah, because that was Jesus too. He said he changed not. You had two or three witnesses. So therefore, if God let one come in, he had to let all of us come yes, in. Yes, all of us can see in all our lives. Wow. I don't need to All of us can see in all our yes. lives. Right <laughs> Is that right? So he let one come in like that. But go back. That man on the cross met God yes. in the grave. And the Lord preached to the captured spirit. Yes. Then we know something happened because it's written in your Bible. That's it. They seen the saints walking mm. in the room mm. when he was yeah. risen from the dead. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. Mm. So I'm telling you, if you don't understand, you start studying today. That's it. You understand what I'm saying? You study. There's some folk trying to wait till the last minute. It ain't gonna work. But if the Lord let one come in mm. at the last minute, all he got to let all of them in. All of them might well just go on to the house and, and, and do whatever you want to do. No, sir. Mm. Commit all the sin you want. No, live no. like you want to live. Or you forget about this. No. Say, I'm going to come in at the last minute. Mm. Hallelujah. I really I have to preach a little this time. Come on, come on. Let, let me tell you, if you try to wait till the last minute, right you don't know what's going to kick you out. Amen. We go out there and have an accident. You know, right. somebody got it already. Somebody right. got it before I ever tell them. Right. Mm -hmm. Somebody may, somebody may just shoot you down on the street. Okay. Accidentally, right. now, they weren't shooting at you, but uh, they got the accident. You, you, know. you, you don't want to. That's why like you want to live. Yeah. Right yeah. Now. Hallelujah. God is good. All the time. He's merciful and he's kind. We thank God. Thank God, thank God. Thank for you. all of you. Thank, thank God you. for all of them. We thank God for the church. Yes. Yes. Hallelujah. And you all know that you do some good for me just coming to church. Yes. Yeah. Thank God for Jesus. Yes. Hallelujah. Today we don't pray for us to hold you long. We're looking in the word of God. Yes. Looking at Colossians 3. And about that. We will just do the 16 and 17 verse. That the word of Christ. Well in you richly. Well in who? In you. Yes, your mother and your father. Yes, well in you. Yes, sir. You need to let the word of God yes, dwell sir. in you. Oh, richly. Yes. In all wisdom. In all wisdom. Teaching and admonishing one another. Teaching and admonishing one another. Teaching and encouraging. That's it. Yes. Hallelujah. Teaching each other. Yes. Hallelujah. Somebody done quit teaching. Uh -huh. Uh -huh. I think about a month or two ago, I, I told the saints, I said, that, that older women need to teach the younger. Yes. That's it. And that older man need to teach those, what, young yes. children, yes. young men. That's it. Yeah, those young men, they need to teach them. Then to somebody don't think it's any good in teaching. Yeah, when the young folk go wrong, that let me know that 
somebody have taught the young ones. Is that right? You need to teach your children. No matter the way they done got wrong, now it's still your responsibility uh, to teach them. When they get wrong, you see them going wrong, and you know what's right. right. You're supposed to teach them. Yeah. Hallelujah. I like the spirit of some of you all around here. I see you teaching and saying. Yeah, that's a good spirit. Yeah. To teach the others that come along, because they don't know. How many know that a lot of young folk think they know? They don't know. Amen. Yeah, some of these young men need to talk to old men like me. Yeah, I, 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 I've been on a job and I never retired from a job. Somebody said, you retired. No, I didn't retire. Hallelujah. I prepared while I was on that job. Though. I meant to prepare while you was on the job. Amen. I made extra money. You better be making some money now. Don't spin and don't eat up everything you got. All right, man. Don't dress out all your money. Mm -hmm. Huh? Amen. Stiletto on all your money. All right, Thank you, Jesus. Yes, you better put some back. Amen. I thank God I talk like this because I came up on an old man. Yes. And the old man used to tell us, like, you give God 10%, put back 10% for yourself. Thank you, Jesus. I'm not bragging. Let, let me tell you this. You, As I was coming up, I seen plans on the job. Yeah, what, what you call a 401k. That's it. Plans on the job. Yeah, you put a thousand dollars in and they'll give you a thousand. Wow. I looked at that. I was young, was coming up and was learning, but I was filled with the Holy Ghost. I said, this. I said, I need something like this. That's it. Somebody gonna give me. That's it. A thousand and that's what I want to get in. Yeah. And I've seen that stock plan. I'm trying to talk to you a little bit. That's it. Yeah. And that stock plan. I'm in the scene of stock plan. Amen. Some of your jobs they have stock plan. Right? Yeah, Lord. And some of the old. That's why I tell you, all racial people are not bad. Mm -hmm. the old Caucasian means. Mm -hmm. Amen. For some reason they just like that. Yeah. See, whenever you, when you're a minister and you save and sanctify folk, I gravitate to you. Thank you, Lord. They come to me, they used to love me, hear me talk, you know, I've been talking to them. I've always been a big talker, y'all know that. They begin to tell me, say, look, won't you put, you know, 10, you could put 10% into the stock plan. Amen. Am I talking to somebody? Yeah, Lord. Hallelujah. Put 10% here, and the company will match your money up to 10%. Yes, they will. I said, will? I said, man, I can't do that. I said, I got three children at home and a wife. I got, to, I got to make sure I take care of them. I can't do it right now. They said, well, put 3% in then. <laughs> they got trouble. They, they wouldn't give up on me. I said, well, you can put 3%.
you make one dollar, yeah, then if God is, then put ten up for yourself too. Hallelujah. God is good. Hallelujah. I better get back to the lesson. I thought I'd diverse a little bit to help you a little bit. Thank God and good God. Come on, what else? One another. Teaching and admonishing one another. In psalms and hymns. Uh, how you gonna do it? In psalms. Psalms are good. That's why I love singing. Yes. I'm in the love singing. Yes. I love singing. Yes. Hallelujah. There's times I go home, I watch YouTube. Right. I watch what I want. Mm -hmm. I say I watch what I want. Yes. Whenever I want a song, I type it in yes, sir. and search. Amen. You type the person name in. Of the song, part of the song, and and God is teaching us that we ought to admonish one another in songs and hymns, church songs. How I many you know you can have church by yourself? By you, are you trying to listen to hip hop? And hip hop and all this, you need to be listening to some church songs. This is what God recognizes. And songs in here, we don't, uh, when we were young, we used to call it the blues. Yeah. Now, you don't need to be listening to the blues. Yeah. Listen to some good, good check songs. Yeah. Especially if those of those you can sing real good, you ought to be singing to yourself. That's it. That's Spiritual it. song. Yeah. Singing like never before. Yeah. I can't sing, but I be singing some songs. Yeah. And there's times I try to get into those old songs. All right. Yeah. I find myself doing what the word already said it then and really never studied it that much. God is a good God. Yeah. And what else, darling? And spiritual songs. And spiritual songs. Singing with grace in your heart. Singing with grace in your heart. To the Lord. Singing to God. Hallelujah. This is telling you something. Hallelujah. Let me bring it up while I'm here. And when you come to these weddings. All right, now. Huh? All right. These folks call themselves in love because they get married, singing what songs to each other all night to be. Because you're supposed to sing with grace in your heart. Yeah. Unto who? Lord. Unto the Lord. We're not supposed to sing love songs one to another. Is that right? But I'm, I'm, I'm saying I can't sing. Mother Chris and I have been married 51 years. I'll be wrong to sit down and sing love songs. <laughs> Is that right? right y'all been, been married a long time. You ain't saying to nobody but uh, uh, uh. Thank you, Jesus. I'll be telling a lot of love. Well, yeah, I'm not going there. That's it. Because I see what God said. You ought to sing under the Lord. Because God knew that we're going to get off. That's it. You start singing one to another. Love songs. Hallelujah. I seen somebody had done enough to get on the floor and dance. Oh, my, my, my. That word of God. Oh, Thank you, Jesus. I got caught trapped two times. Oh, <laughs> <laughs> because, because they was way up. Uh, I see that they ain't, they ain't just do a whole lot of movement. They just got close together. What is say in a grateful mood? Uh, it's a dance. Uh, you're not supposed to do that. Amen. If you dance, you ought to dance before the Lord. Somebody criticized David because he danced out of his court. But he was dancing as much as he do under the spirit. Praising his God. Because he was happy. Thank God a good God. If you dance, you ought to come on to the church. Yes. You're a good dancer. Y'all know we, we don't start this from here now. Thank you, Jesus. You ought to dance until the Lord. Not like you see these folks on the internet now. How many have been watching them? Mm, they get out there, they dress up in a certain way and start just dancing and dancing and dancing. And I don't know about you, but my spirit let me know that they're wrong. How many get that unction that they are wrong? When you, 
When you dance before the Lord, you're supposed to be in the spirit. Amen. If the spirit don't move you, just throw your hand up. Amen. If the spirit don't move you, hallelujah. Yes. Thank you, Jesus. Now if God get in your feet, right, then you go forth in the dance. Uh, somebody got a little angry with one of our leaders because they talked about folk dancing. And what he seen, they went under the spirit. Then you're supposed to move under the spirit of the man of God. Huh? How you know, Brother Curtis? Because when the Lord filled me with the Holy Ghost, I'm ashamed. But I, I noticed myself, I'd be over between them pews at Philip Temple, just moving. That's it. Mm -hmm. Yeah, your other pastor used to be a Ella Ennis. I seen him, on, he was on the other side, dancing too. All, right. uh, all I know what spirit I was in. That's I right. what spirit the other Help myself straight. You got to keep yourself straight Amen. when it comes to God. Mm -hmm. And dancing and praising Him my, my, my. is what we do. Come on, That's what else? And whatsoever ye do in word or deed, listen to the word. Listen to the holy word of God. Yes, yes. God said, and whatsoever you do in word of deed, do all in the name of the Lord Jesus. Do it in somebody else's name. Do it in the name of the Lord Jesus. Huh? Thank you, Jesus. Do it all. Yes. Not just part of it, right. but do it all. Whatever you do, yeah. as a saint of God, I don't care where you are. That's why I was so glad to get off of my job. I had a good job at United Gate, but I was glad to go. Sometimes you work with other men. Thank you, Jesus. They, they hear me. They, they say, Craig, why you talked about that? And what they do on your time sheet, they write. But well, we did this and we did that and we did this. Because they was the technician and I was the helper. I had to write what he wrote. I got tired of that. So I got to praying and praying. You know, God will hear your prayer. He know that you want to do right. Yeah. You hear your prayer. Before I knew it, I became the technician. Thank Isn't that Lord. right? And I made sure I did everything that I won't have to foster, falsify records. Huh? You have to do everything with God in mind. Hallelujah. Yeah. And if you do it some other way, then you're wrong. You can't agree job, and you got to do it right. Man, hiring you to work, you ought to make sure you work. Yeah, make sure you work. Yeah, yeah, you don't have to tell them every day what you're doing, as long as you're working, you're in compliance, hallelujah, with what you're supposed to do. Yeah. Whatsoever you do, in word or deed, do all in the name of the Lord Jesus. Mm -hmm. And giving thanks, thanks to God. To God. And the Father by him. And the Father by him. Hallelujah. Do it all in Jesus' name. Yeah, yeah. We're blessed because everything we do. In the name of Jesus. Mm -hmm. If I'm doing something, I'm doing it in the name That's it. of Jesus. That's, it. That's why I tell the enemy, how many know that all of us have enemies? Yeah. If you don't have any, you beware when all That's men it. speak well of me. All men are not going to speak well of me. All Amen. men. A lot of folks be telling you they love you, you better watch it. That's it. How many know what I'm talking about? Amen. You better watch it. Folks tell me, that, yeah, I sure enough love you. I, I know there's one that most time buddy you up the more. Yeah, all right, man. 
They're the one that'll do you no more. Amen. Isn't that right? They try to hurt you. Beware. I watch all the time. That, that, that's sure enough. Then uh, I'm very careful too, y'all. I don't need to tell everything. I'm very careful to warn that sometimes you help them more. All right, man. Just to Amen. warn that hurt you. Amen. How many Amen. know that?
looks like you messed up in the end. Oh, uh, don't worry about it. Keep praying. Hallelujah. Amen. Keep on doing what you're doing. Amen. It just looks like that. Amen. Hallelujah. Whatever the Lord does, yes. it's always going to be successful. Amen. You do it in the right way. Thank God, good God. Yeah. In the Bible, right. a person's name has some meaning. Yes. How many know that? In the Bible, Amen. they didn't just name folks. Mm -hmm. Hallelujah. But they had special names that yes. mean something. Mm -hmm. Yeah, that person named his name. Hallelujah. Talked about his character. Mm hmm. Yeah, it also let you know who he was, and he recognized his name. Yes. Hallelujah. Elohim is the creator. Yes. Yeah. Talking about God and creation. Yes. Mm -hmm. Yeah, and hallelujah. And this let you know that God is the one that created everything. This same person is the Lord Jesus Christ. Yeah. Hallelujah. We don't have to use all those names anymore. Yeah. Yahweh. Yeah. yeah, it is, hallelujah, the covenant keeping God. Hallelujah, as we know. Uh, yeah, yeah. You don't you don't have to use all these names anymore. Amen.
sister and brother, he said, don't come and tell me a God. I said, man, who, who you talking about, God? God can do anything. He made the world. I said, well, I looked around as a child. So if he made the world, he can show up and do something. Amen. Amen. that you're looking at, he made that. Hallelujah. I knew it was something unusual. Somebody ought to know it's something unusual about God. But when God saved me, he let me know who he is. How many realize who he is? Who he really is. Yeah. Since you've been saved. Yeah, yeah before I wondered about that. Mm -hmm. But now I know. Thank you, Thank you Jesus. Yeah. Thank you. Let's talk a little about God. Mm -hmm. In Isaiah 45 and 21. Thank you, Jesus. Mm -hmm. Isaiah 45 and 21. Bible talks about him being Lord. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Did we see that? Amen. Thank you, Jesus. Tell me. Mm -hmm. And bring them near. Say, bring them near. Yea, let them take counsel together. Mm -hmm. Who have declared this from ancient time. Yeah. Who have told it from that time. Mm -hmm. Had not I the Lord? He said, not I the Lord. And there is no God else beside me. And there's Amen. no God else beside me. Who is who are you talking about? Yeah. Who is this? Mm -hmm. Yeah. yeah. Uh, he is the Lord. Yeah. Uh, you, you can find out who the Lord is. Yeah. Then you ought to know. <laughs> Hallelujah. Jesus. Then you're going to know his name. Jesus. That's 9 and 5. Ooh. Thank you, Jesus. Act 9 and 5. And he said? And he said. No, let, let's go up to the fourth verse. We, no, 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 I, 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 I'm going to teach you to somebody else. All right. And he fell to the earth. And he fell. This he is Saul. The Bible says he fell to the earth. And heard a voice saying unto him. And heard a voice saying unto him. Saul, Saul. Saul. He heard a voice saying to him, Saul. Everybody understand that Saul is Paul. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Mm -hmm. yeah, he said, Saul, Saul. Why persecutest thou me? He said, Why persecutest thou me? And he said, And he said, Who art thou, Lord? Look at the word Lord. Y'all mm -hmm. got it by now. Mm -hmm. He said, Who art thou, Lord? Mm -hmm. And the Lord said, And the Lord said, I I am Jesus. I am Jesus. Whoever said in the Old Testament that he was Lord, now we don't found him. How many sin? How many really sin? Somebody can be reading and still don't see. Say, who are thy Lord? Now. I oftentimes tell it like this. If you don't understand the uh -huh. Lord. Mm -hmm. I got it. Now, when we were in the earlier grades in school, I remember just about the third and fourth grade, I think we really got the lower keys and, and, and the upper keys letter. Now, if we see that this is what a capital how many see that? We should have learned this in elementary school. Capital L O R D. If you can't do anything else, I tell you to match it up. How many do how to match things up? You can look at the words in the Old Testament. It's a capital L O R D. It's talking about God. New Testament, capital L O R D, talking about God. Yeah. Here, the Lord let you know who He is. Yeah. So I said, "Who are thou, Lord?" And the Lord said, "Hallelujah!" Understand? Understand what's going on? Amen. Yeah. 
Another scripture tells me that Saul was not off his beats and he was looking up towards uh -huh. heaven. Uh -huh. And he, the sun, he seen the sun yes. uh -huh. brighter than the noonday sun. He looked up. There, there was a light brighter than the noonday sun. Come on now. Amen. Thank he looked up. Hallelujah. Evidently that it was Jesus showing himself yes, brighter than the sun. Yes, Hallelujah. Thank you, Jesus. No wonder David said he, the bright and morning star. Yes, yes, Hallelujah. Yes, Thank you, Jesus. How did they come higher? Yes, Jesus. No wonder those old science teachers used to teach us that a star is no more than the sun. Come on here. <laughs> I better do that. I learned that, you know, in school. It stayed in my mind. I evidently stayed there so I could use it in the ministry. Whoa. That star of the little sun. Mm -hmm. But Jesus Whoa. was greater than the noonday sun. Yeah. He's greater because he was more yeah. than the sun. The sun yeah. needs energy yeah. from yeah. some other source. Yeah. But all the energy is in Jesus. Yeah. He can do anything. He is the almighty God. Hallelujah. Who are thy Lord? And the Lord said. Hallelujah. Don't tell nobody that Bishop Curtis said it. Hallelujah. If I would do it right, I'd say, I quote. <laughs> is that right? If you write in a paper, you say, I quote. Because they take off from your paper. If you say it like you said it, there's somebody else. Hallelujah, information. And the Lord said, I am Jesus. I am Jesus. Oh, I'm in a God this today. Oh, I am Jesus. Whom I persecute. Yes, Tell all the skeptics when you talk to them, when they warn them, when you are they fighting against the name of Jesus. Let them say that Jesus said, didn't say it to you, he said it to me. Yes. I read it. Uh -huh. I am Jesus. Saul asked the question, who are thou, Lord? Mm -hmm. And the Lord Jesus, whatever spirit that was beforehand, before Saul knew it, he said, I am Jesus. Mm -hmm. Whom thy person Yeah. 
ending from the beginning, therefore he never made any mistakes. He knew it. You just didn't understand what God was doing. No, you didn't understand. Hallelujah. God never made a mistake. God knew what he was doing. God didn't have to change things. Because he knew. God knows. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. Thank you, Jesus. It's man who don't go. Yeah, yeah. and God a good God. In yeah, yeah. 13, yeah, 17 through the 18 verse. Yeah, yeah, Manoah, he want to know his name. And Manoah said. Huh? The, the Bible said, read. And Manoah said unto the angel of the Lord. And Manoah said unto the angel. Of the Lord. What is thy name? He said, What is your name? That, that when thy sayings come to pass, mm -hmm. we may do thee honor. That we may do you honor. And the angel of the Lord said unto him, And the angel of the Lord said unto him, Why askest thou thus after my name? He said, Why you ask after my yeah. name? Seeing it is secret. Seeing that it is a secret. So the Lord took a kid with I'm in the new at that time that God named. Was a secret. Yeah. Hallelujah. That's the angel of the Lord, capital L O R D. Mm, I, I, I might have to show you something else. And what else, daughter? So Manoah took a kid mm -hmm. with a meat offering. But Manoah found out that God's name at this time was a secret. Yeah. In the Old Testament. His name was a secret. Jacob wanted to know his name. Mm -hmm. and at, at that time, the Lord Jesus didn't even attempt to answer him. He just kept going. He didn't give him no answer. He didn't let him know his name was a secret or nothing. He just didn't tell him his name. Amen. Huh? Amen. Mm -hmm. Yeah, but his name was a secret all through Hallelujah. the Old Testament. Thank you, Jesus. Somebody ought to be glad about it. Amen. Mm -hmm. And others get, they, they get a little hung up because they see the word, the angel of the Lord. Mm -hmm. But oftentimes, God will show up as an angel. They call him the angel of the Lord at that time. Ain't God a good God? It's good to know some things. A lot of times, some people think they, they, they speak some things and they can cause trouble to come on themselves because they speak without not. A lot of things you don't know, you ought to be quiet about it. Leave it alone. Is that right? Hallelujah. God is God. I don't care what anybody says. He is God. Hallelujah. And he's the almighty God. He does what he pleases. Amen. Thank you, Jesus. Thank yes, God a good God. Yes, and Jeremiah 13 and 22, let's see what it says. And Manoah said unto his wife. And Manoah said, listen to those who are skeptic, yeah. who don't believe what the word says. Yes, sir. Don't believe what the preacher said. Mm -hmm. And Manoah said unto his wife. Listen to what she said. She said, we shall surely die. Because we have seen God. Because what? We have seen God. Amen. You got to understand who. Who was there? Who he was talking to? Mm -hmm. My Lord was talking to the angel of the Lord. Amen. And the angel of the Lord, he, this is where he showed up. Mm -hmm. He said, we shall surely die. Ooh. Because we have what? Seen God. Just let you know who he was. Amen. Ain't God a good God. Amen. I got to get out of here, y'all. <laughs> Hallelujah. You see God, you better hold to it. Yes. Don't let the enemy send them strong delusions. Yes. Make you think he needs some help. He don't need no help. No, he don't. He's the almighty God. I'm back through y'all. I reckon I am. Thank you, Jesus. Yeah, he is God. He's God all by himself. Hallelujah. The Bible let us know for by 
him were all things created. Yeah. That same God. Yeah. By him all things were created. Yeah. Hallelujah. I wish I wish that the young folk could get this. Right. But you're going to need it one day. Yeah. Thank you, Jesus. And the word of God says, and it's going forth have been from old, from everlasting to everlasting. Yes. God gone, going forth. Amen. Hallelujah. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you. He is a good God. Yes. Yeah, from the beginning, God has been moved yes, toward the new. Mm -hmm. Leaving the old, coming to the new. Amen. Thank you, Jesus. Saul wanted to know, who art thou? Yeah. David had already told him in the 23rd Psalm, yeah. that the Lord is my shepherd. Yeah. Yeah, the 27th Psalm says, the Lord is my light yeah. and yeah. my salvation. Yeah. Oh, Hallelujah. Who? Yeah. Oh. Thank you, Jesus. I don't have any reason to be oh. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. All things were made by him. Hallelujah. Let, let's see what Isaiah 4, 28 and 31 say. Hallelujah. The Bible says, all things, anything you see, were made by the Lord Jesus Christ. I wonder y'all getting something out of this. Y'all young people call your minds in. Thank you, Jesus. I think you're trying to wonder. But you're going to need this one day. Thank God a good God. Yeah, all things were made by him. What Isaiah 40, 28 and 31 says in the first verse. Have thou not known? Have thou not known? Have thou not heard? Have thou not heard? That the everlasting God, the Lord. The everlasting God, the who? The Lord. The Lord. The the creator of the end of the earth. Fainteth not. He fainteth not. Neither is he weary. Neither is he weary. There is no searching of his Ooh. understanding. There is no searching Ooh. of his understanding. Give his power to the faint. Mm -hmm. And to them that have no might. Yeah. He increases strength. Thank he God. increases strength. Even the youth shall mm -hmm. faint. Mm -hmm. And be weary. Yeah. And the young men shall utterly fall. Yeah. Thank you, Jesus. Came down to a dying world. Yeah. How 
happened to know that we would die. Yes. Yes. Isaiah looked up and seen him coming. Yes. Said, all we like yes. have gone astray. Yes. We have turned everyone to his own. Yes. And the Lord laid on him yes. the iniquity of all. Somebody ought to thank God. Hallelujah. He said something very important. He said he was wounded for our transgressions. Wounded for our transgressions. He was bruised for our iniquity. And the church time of our peace was laid on him. But I like it about it. He said, with his stripes. Thank you, Jesus. That Jesus took the stripes for you. With his stripes, we'll heal. Hallelujah. How many feel healed this morning? I feel healed. I feel saved. Solomon said the name of the Lord is a strong God. And the righteous running into you. Somebody ought to be coming to Jesus. That the righteous running into you. And he'll say, Hallelujah. I heard him saying, David said, He's our shield and our foot. Thank you, Jesus. He's our high tower. Thank you, Jesus. And I heard him saying that our rock is not like their rock. Thank you, Jesus. I don't care what they say. They say we serve the same God. Some of us right among each other, not saying we serve the same God. Thank you, Jesus. But I want you to know that our rock. Hallelujah is a rock Hallelujah of ages. A rock that would never give away. Talking about the Lord Jesus Christ. Thank you, Jesus. I can find no fault in it. I'm going to find some fault in it. Thank you, Jesus. What the Lord have done is still good right now. Thank you, Jesus. I'm so glad to know for myself. Thank you, Jesus. Hallelujah, that Moses said in the beginning, God created yes, yes. the heaven and earth. John picked it up and said he was in the world. And the world was made by him. And the world drew him out. I'm going to know they still don't know Jesus. Don't know who he is. Thank you, Jesus. He's the only God that came here. He's the only God that's coming back. He's coming back for a church yeah. if I spot the ring. A innocent thing. Yeah. If I went right, I'd be getting it right with God. The song said, get it right with God. Yeah. And do it right now. Thank God a good God. Hallelujah. He came down. Hallelujah. Through 42 generations. Traveling through the, the telescope of time. Coming to a dying world. Thank you, Jesus. With outstretched hands. Looking under you, say, Come unto me, all ye that me. And the heavenly, he said, I'll give you rest. You want rest from your sin? You ought to come to me. You want rest from a burning hell? Come to me. You want rest from this evil world? You ought to come to Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. He's standing with outstretched hands. I want to save you. Thank you, Jesus. That God so loved the world that he gave his only begotten son that whosoever believed in him should not perish but have everlasting life. If you want to live, come to Jesus. We bring your life to death. It was life in his hand. It was life in his voice. Life all over him. The woman that had an issue of blood they back and just touch. How many have been trying to touch him? Just touch. You can just touch his clothes. Life in his clothes. Whatever you wear. Life all over you. Thank you, Jesus. Want you to know God is a healer. He is a deliverer. Thank you, Jesus. He's your only source. 
that will help you in time of trouble. Thank you, Jesus. As he come, to this, he came to this dying world. So I've come that you might have life. Life more than that. God is a good God. I'm going to stop the day. Thank you, Jesus. I want you to get a taste of who he is. I want to give you too much. I've been trying to get you to digest too much. And it hasn't been going down right. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. But you need to utilize it. You need to go through your body. Hallelujah. Not go out the other way. But you need it in your body. You need to know who Jesus is. He is the almighty God. And he can do anything. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I usually tell the church. He's the one that stepped out into our darkness and let there be light. And the light came. Thank God a good God. He's the one that scooped up the dust of that and bomb man. Hallelujah. And scooped and stooped down and breathed in his nostrils. Man became a living soul. What a mighty God. Thank you, Jesus. The old poet said that God said he stepped out. Hallelujah. And the out of darkness stepped out into space and said, I'm lonely. That's the way he said that. To our baby a man. God made him a man. That man went weary. Thank you, Jesus. And one day, when it went wrong, God came walking in the cool of the day. Hallelujah. And he called out the man and said, Adam. I wonder, can you hear God? Adam. Thank you, Jesus. Man, where are you? Thank you, Jesus. He said, we heard your voice walking. I'm in know that God word had life. So they're walking in the car. Mm -hmm. In the cool of the day, we went here ourselves. And man knew that he was naked. Mm -hmm. All the other time, he met with God. Hallelujah. He met with him. He was glad to see him. Yeah. I, I could see man. Yeah. Hallelujah. I can see him running to God. Mm -hmm. I mean, I ever ran to God. Mm -hmm. I see him running to God. God, he was glad that God was showing up. But this time, mm -hmm. when he went wrong, yeah. he ran from him. Mm -hmm. He got big leaves yeah. and put it around him. Yeah. Because he realized he was naked. Yeah. Somebody got to realize where you are now. You got to realize where you are. If you don't realize where you are, honey, you can leave here and go to that other place. And it's not a nice place. As we were saying this morning, you will never get out of there. Thank you, Jesus. But the Lord wasn't pleased with the outfit he had. So he slew the animal. How many know he had to slew the animal for him to make, make him clothes out of what animal skin? To cover himself up. Hallelujah. But he couldn't stay where he was. A lot of times you see people running, they can't stay where they are. Thank you, Jesus, because something went weird. Mm -hmm. Something went wrong in their life. Thank you, Jesus. God put them out to God. Sometimes some think they're leaving on their own. Mm -hmm. Hallelujah. But it's God. It's bad when you fight by God. Mm -hmm. Thank you, Jesus. If you fight by God, nobody can hide you back. Amen. God, let me lead up. God is a good God. He's a good God. But the Bible tells us without the shedding of blood, oh, yeah. there's no remission of sin. You ought to thank God for the shedding of blood. Thank you, Jesus. There was too much blood that has been shed in the Old Testament. But I can hear Jesus, hallelujah, saying to the angelic host, hallelujah, he said, I go down. We talking about even when he was in heaven. Yes. Uh, yeah, hallelujah. We paraphrasing. And I go down and redeem man yes, and bring him back to God. Amen. You ought to thank God that Jesus Amen. came down. Amen. Hallelujah. Amen. Hallelujah. All the animals they sacrificed over and over. Yes. Thank you, Jesus. Had 
had to be it had to be done year after year. But when Jesus came down, hallelujah, and brought that pure blood. Hallelujah. Sacrifice that pleased God. Thank you, Jesus. Hallelujah. The shed his blood on Mount Calvary. Thank you, Jesus. How many know this blood is still good to this day? Thank God that God's blood, it, it, it go from one generation to another. Yes, and it, 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 it worked, so it worked for me back in 1970. God filled me with the Holy Ghost, yes. cleansed me up, made something out. God will do it for you, young man. Yes, he will. If you want to be. Yes, he will. He'll do it for you. If I were you, I'd come running to you. Because he has the answer. He has the answer. But I'm pleased with you today. Don't wait. Until it's late. Too late. Late is bad enough. I mean, no late. Sometimes you can get by late. But when you're too late. Somebody said it's too late now. You can't open the door. We don't have the key. Too late. When the sun starts going down. Too late. Your tongue begin Cleave to the roof of your mouth. Today. Hallelujah. Come unto me. Oh, ye that labor and the heavy laden. God said, He'll give you rest. Come now. Before it's too late. God is a good God. Hallelujah. Thank you, Jesus. We need Him. If we ever need Him. We need him now. Hallelujah. You see the signs, but you're missing what the signs are saying. Come now. God giving you another warning. It's almost too late. Thank you, Jesus. Somebody said, well, who report you going to believe? I believe the report of the old one. <laughs> yeah. I'm not afraid to tell folks. I believe what the old saints told me back in 1970. Back in 1970, I was in sure enough in bad fix. I was messed up. I need some help bad. Yes, sir. And I did exactly what they said. Amen. God filled me with the Holy Ghost. Thank you, Lord. And I've been filled ever since. Amen. The old report, it was 